So one okay. CS says, I'm watching from Ashaiman. Okay. Teachers in schools, in a way, play a parenting role once a the child... is a fair play to raise, to raise <laughs> tough kids, you know. <laughs> once the child goes to school. So how do biological parents marry their upbringing and that of the teachers? Yeah. I, I think I covered that last week. Yes. Yeah. I was very strong that I put the responsibility on the parents. Because, right. you know, uh, first of all, crash has a, an, a, 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 a start and an end period. Yeah. Very short. Sure. Then um, caging, mm -hmm. they have a period. And then class one to six, it has a period. Mm -hmm. Then GHS one to three, it has a period. Mm. SHS one to three, now they even have one week for one year. <laughs> you know, I, I, we, we don't want to talk about that. So that one also has a period. So all these phases yeah. of a child's upbringing, there's only one C, one constant, the mom and the dad or the guardian. True. Yeah. So the, 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 the back never rests with the school. I, I really absorb the school because our system is not, it is nasty now. The worst system is nasty. We have all kinds of crazy things being to, uh, tried to be pumped into, into schools. School. I mean, you feel in the form now, there's gender, ma Ghana, <laughs> male, female, other, other. So I don't want to go there, but the parents <laughs> must be responsible because it's, it, these are your kids. They carry yeah. your name. They don't yeah. carry the master chest name. name or the headmistress name or the school's name. <laughs> Nobody is called Odadia. Yeah. Nobody is called Bleu. Yeah. So I, I'm not saying they don't have something to do. No, they have something to do, but they reinforce mm. what I've been laid in. So even then, we even have to ask ourselves who qualifies to teach your child. Mm. The math teacher is a, called to teach mathematics, but is that all they are teaching your children? What is the social and the psychological uh, influence? How do they come to me? For, because many years ago, you could trust your kids mm. with, the, with the teachers. Yeah. Wow. And yeah, right. you could. You could do that. I mean, sometimes their kids don't even listen to you. You get the teacher, teachers to work teacher with them. That, was, that is when you have a teacher yeah. who starts with you in class one, yeah. then it takes you to class two, yeah. class three. And throughout your entire life, the teacher will refuse anything from the family, unless maybe it's Christmas. Because each time we don't give anything, we receive. But are they want it before they like even that. go ahead now, to do anything? Now it's La Lambia. <laughs> <laughs> you know, now it's about the money. Yeah. So uh, the motive is already corrupted. Right. We have teachers now who yeah. pass your child because you're paying them for extra classes. They'll pass your child all the way. And I like teachers. Look, none of us, look, none of us will be here without a teacher. That's and true. I celebrate that. But I'm telling you the reality. Mm. So they will teach them and let your child pass. Mm -hmm. And my friend, uh, the owner of Rising Sun, uh, it's been a long while, Mr. Chapel, Richard Chapel, he showed me this trick. He said, look, they'll pass your child sir, and do the college with the next teacher mm. to also take over. <laughs> so you think, and they'll be passing your child until the SHS exam comes. Yeah, then you realize Because that. I get him and then, shit, you see, the devil has entered my home. <laughs> no. So I, I'm, I'm not saying the, the teachers can do a lot. Right. If you find a very good teacher, don't let them go. Mm. Hang on to them, hold them well, you know. So that is important, but mm. majority is the parental thing. Mm. And then monitoring.